Hello everyone, it's me Forever Sunshine here and welcome back to another video. So today I am going to be chatting you guys through my monthly favorites for May. What? It's May? It's the end of May and it's legit May 31st. Tomorrow's June 1st and a month from tomorrow is my 14th birthday. You know what people say, time goes by when you're having fun. I have never related to anything more. Um, but we're not going to talk about the time flying by. We're going to talk about some of my favorite products from new books to new hair products to 100% new shows and new music that I've really, really been enjoying. So if you guys do want to hear some of my favorite things, please leave a like on the video and let's get started. So before I do anything on the actual physical items, I want to sit down and talk to you guys about some of my new favorite music. First things first, I've been really enjoying Stir Fry from Migos. I've also been enjoying Can't Feel My Face from The Weeknd. Um, Lose It from A Wonder. Some of these songs are very old. I did just get a new phone. I got the iPhone 8. Finally, after my upgrade is done, I got to get a new phone, which I really do love. And it's great. So I had to transfer all my old music back and I got to listen to some of the old songs that I've been listening to forever. Um, One Call Away from Charlie Puth. Um, other songs that I've been listening to are also... Oh my god, this song I've been so obsessed with is... Um... Clargy X Valerie Brownsard, The Beginning of the End, heard this from Riverdale, Lapsley, Falling Short, also from Riverdale, and Belly Alish Board, and most of her songs have been in my mind all freaking months. Um, also, Riverdale has been a new upcoming show. Um, the second season just came out. I am almost finished with it, and I've been so in love with it. This first season was incredible and the second season is amazing so a lot of the songs I also got were from Riverdale which I do really really enjoy so if you're interested look up um on YouTube just like the Riverdale 2 season soundtrack and you would definitely find a lot of the songs I've been really really enjoying so let's get on to physical objects and first freaking things first this book holy crap beautiful creatures was a book that I got to pick for my language arts class and you got a certain selection of books and this was the one that really caught my eye. My sister read it and said she loved it and I was like, okay, I'm gonna start it. Um, so I actually just finished the book today. So we had a deadline. We started this about a week and a half ago and the pages in this book is 567 pages long and it had to be due and finished by tomorrow, which is June 1st. And I was really stressed and reading through this and I, honest to God, never have fallen in love with the book more. This book is very spiritual and very romance and the two main characters um, are very, very entertaining and the whole book really is incredible. Very supernatural, very romance, action, a lot, a lot of cliffhangers has also put me, you know, in shock. I honest to god think that the two main characters are the cutest thing you'll ever see in your life so if you guys are really interested please please go and read beautiful creatures i'm going to be reading the second book beautiful darkness which is the sequel to beautiful creatures and i know there's another version of this too which i'm so excited so definitely so happy i got to read this definitely made my month and i'm really happy i actually finished it today so going on to products um today i'm going to show you guys first this the tresemme um <coughs> Oh my god, I choked on my spit. The Climate Protection um, holds for all hair type. I have been spraying this in um, my hairbrush and I've just been combing it through before or after I either straighten it or don't straighten it. And this has really, really helped my hair like keep tame and not like have a major freak out due to the weather changing and to the really, really hot um, climate in the place where I'm living right now. This has really, really helped. And I really do love it. So another one that's also been helping me has been the Smooth and Seal, the Smooth Sexy Hair. This is an anti-frizz and shine spray. I've been spraying this also in my hairbrush, combing through it, just making it look very straight and natural and very just healthy. And I really do enjoy both of these sprays. They both smell amazing as well, which I love. So this is such a weird one because I feel really old whenever I talk about this. This is the um, Downy Light Fresh Scent Wrinkle Releaser. So I'm one of the people who leave my clothes on hangers if I'm going to wear them in the next week. And I constantly get wrinkles in my clothes because I really just don't like do anything. So I've been spraying this in it and it's been really taking out all of the wrinkles. And I did it on my shirt today and I'm 
almost halfway empty with this. It smells so good. Like, I honest to God get all the wrinkles out of my shirt whenever I put it on. I don't know what it does, but it works and it's really good. So, feel old saying this, but if you guys want to throw this like your handbag or purse or whatever, really helpful and really, really good. So, um, keeping with the sprays, this has been my all-time favorite perfume of the month. This is the Victoria's Secret Love perfume. Um, very sweet, very, very strong, but it does die down after you have it on for about five minutes. Um, it's kind of floral and it's very, like, summery, but can go pretty much all season round. I really, really love it, though, and I definitely have been wearing this and spritzing it on before I go out the door, which I very much so love. So... Going on to one item of skincare that I really sure sh sh how to call it straight away from there you go um has been the Clean and Clear Essentials Deep Cleansing Um Astrogen. This is a toner, and I used to use this toner almost every day, but I kind of stopped doing it because I didn't feel like it was doing a lot for my skin until I had a big pimple in the center of my forehead and um on my nose and around my hairline. I was getting stress pimples from having to read Beautiful Creatures in less than a week. Um, and I put this on it and it completely wiped it in like two days. Really, really helped my skin and it's been really good and this has really been used a lot. As you can tell there's an actual hair in it. Sorry about that. I cannot get it out, there you go. Um, really good, easy, clean, clear, and it's very, very good. Next has been make- oh wait, I will do one more, sorry. Um, this is the Zoella Body Pudding um, in her summer line from 2016. No, 17. It looks like this. And it's really, really good. I'm putting it on after I shave. And it's very sweet scented and smells a lot like summer. And I've really, really enjoyed using it a lot. I think it's very good. And the pearls feel really soft on your skin after you shave or to see the good moisturize. So I've been using this a lot and it's really, really good. Next is makeup. And I have been loving this highlighter recently. This is the um, Baked DLS highlighter in the color Bellissa Mia. It's B I. B-E-L-L-I-S-S-I-M-A. -S it's a very pinky, shimmery highlight, but whenever you put it on, it's very, like, opal and very pretty and, like, lightish pink. And I've been really, really liking this. It's been one of my favorites. Really good with a Morphe brush. I'm just telling you right now. Um, next has been an all-time old favorite. This has been the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Aqua Concealer in the color Fair Light. I used to use this every day, and I kind of strayed away from it and started using this one. Where, ooh, my... Mascara almost just fell there. Um, I've been using this mas this concealer, but I started using this one because it's waterproof and I really, really like it. It's really good and just putting it under my eyes has made me look a hundred times more awake and I really like it a lot. And then an old favorite has finally rolled back into the um, usage, which is the Benefit Roller Lash. I'm wearing it right now. It makes your eyelashes look very big and very big, very big and very luscious, sorry. And, um... I really, really love this. It's been an old favorite and I didn't touch it for a while, but now it's really been on my eyelashes every single day. This is also going to go to help, which is the CoverGirl True Blend. Um, the translucent setting powder, it's not like a setting powder, it's also like a foundation. I've been using that a lot, just if I don't want to have a ton of makeup on, I want to be very light and not wear any concealer. Placing this on like the bad parts of my skin or just my redness or whatever has really really helped um keep my skin just looking healthy if i don't want a full face of makeup on and practically last but not least has been the zoella body fondant shimmer balm macaroon scented sh body shimmer this is a really old favorite from about 2016. oh my god anyone has watched that i'm so sorry um this is a like shimmer body fondant which you can use to pretty much add any shimmer. Clearly, if you guys can see on my finger now, after I just dabbed it in there, it's a very big shimmer and it's really, really nice. Um, sorry about the, like, the little like flex and stuff in it, but it looks like this. It's a kind of like bronzy shimmer in case you just want to put it on and look a little bit glamorous. You take this little cotton pad thingy, looks like this. It's very cute. You take a little bit of this and then you just put it on any places where you want a little bit more of a shimmer. Hopefully the camera is picking that up, but if it is, you can definitely tell. I'll put it on my arms here. It's really, really good. I love it so much and the scent is incredible. And I can't even tell you how amazing it is. It smells like summer in a freaking 
fondant and it's amazing and I've been using this so so much so guys that has been pretty much my monthly favorites for the month of May um, I hope you guys will have a great great beginning of the summer I get out of school in about a week and I'm so so excited and I cannot wait so please leave a like on the video if you guys enjoy and if you guys want more makeup and more beauty products and things like this please also subscribe and turn on the notification bell if you guys are interested and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye! Mwah, mwah, mwah.